I don't even know what day it is. Today is July 20th, 2013. And this is the fifth day I have been stuck in my house. Due to the weather and my health. Um, let me just emphasize something. Remember when I talked about having a small problem and not t turning it into an overwhelming problem and then you can't handle it? I want you to think about this before you go to bed tonight or, or, or maybe you're just getting up and you're just tuning in. But it's not good to have small problems, whatever they are, turn into an overwhelming problem and then you don't know how to handle it. Because your mind is going in 30 different directions. What do I do first? Do I do this? Do I do that? Do I do I do I and then you your mind is just blown blown to pieces. If anybody hits me up from that movie about um, putting a dog inside a park park cart in the summer, I'm going to block you, and I will tell you the honest truth: that is a crime. Because I have evidence that I saw it. It's on Facebook. You can do the research yourself. I think the movie was made by College Humor or Humors or whatever. Summer, yay or nay. But somebody wrote back to me today and they said, What's the matter? Can't you take a joke? This is not a joke. This is this is a crime. And you could be punished or fined. Because if if a dog is put in a parked car in, on a hot day, they could die. Because they cool themselves off by panting. Get this into your little, little brain. Whoever's watching this, they cool themselves off by panting. And if you're going to go make a stupid ass movie, then I think you need to get your facts straight first. And not go say something. And then you're going to get a lot of complaints about it. Because I took offense to that. Some people are so so stupid. They're so stupid. We have three television stations in the Pittsburgh area, and that's all I'm saying. And all three of them, well, I don't even know how to even say this. Let me think about it a little bit. Because um, I'm not feeling well tonight. My, my beagle, I was outside with my beagle. My husband was trying to help me. And I'm... Oh, eyes were itching. And my... You know, this was burning, and my lungs were burning, and I said, let's just get this over with, please, because I can't take much more, but turned out she had a, a baby bunny in her mouth. I thought it was a rat. Unfortunately, I don't know if it's going to be able to live the night, knowing that these, um, 
cats that roam the alley. I'll probably have a midnight snack and it'll be uh, in rabbit heaven by morning. And uh, this cute little thing made me want to think of Easter Bunny and buying jelly beans. And at least I got to hold it for a while. Even if it's, it was just a little thing. It may have a short life, I don't know. You have to learn to tackle your problems while they're small before they get big. And if you can't do it, find somebody else to help you. Don't be embarrassed. Another thing I want to talk about I've been stuck in a house and I've been dying to get body modification piercings. And I've done a few. D D I Y do it yourself and you're only asking for trouble. <sighs> Leave it to the professionals, please. I still haven't gotten my ears stretched yet to twelve. This is fourteen. Oh man, I just I can't stand this heat. I'm sorry, but it has not been a fun week. I hope next week is better. I've got to sign off because I don't feel good. Good night.